like it here because I can always QB dooby dooby do it. My name's Tizzy and I love it when I'm busy. QB dooby 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 doing it too. My name's Dink. At least that's what I think. I can usually QB dooby dooby do it. My name's Doody and I love being a QB because there's things to QB dooby do all day. We've got boingles and people and wigwams and seeds and skeeters that hum like mosquitoes. We can cubie dooby do, we can cubie dooby do, we can cubie dooby do it all the day! Hooray! Where are the others? They're meant to be meeting me here. Hello, Doody! Have you seen the dick? Hello! Come along, Doody! Am I late? Just a little. Sorry. Where's your skeeter? Were we meant to have them? Yes, Dink. It's the skeeter race today. Remember? Oh. You're being a bit slow today, Dink. You'll never win the race that way. Sorry. Get your skeeter, Dink. Oh, yes. Silly me. <laughs> Now, does everyone remember the rules? Yes. No. Well, Dink, you have to follow the signposts. Signposts. The signposts tell us which way to go. And they tell us what we have to leave to prove we've been there. Oh. It sounds ever so complicated. It's easy. Come on, let's get going. Where do we go first, Boz? I won't well, know until I use the Z. Everyone ready? Yes! Yeah. Yeah. Ready? Steady? Go! Hey, hey. 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 The food signpost is first. That means you have to put a foot down the same color as yourself. Right then, where could this sign post be? <laughs> Dink's got a very good idea. Let's go and leave your yeah. food. It looks like Tizzy's already been here. How can you tell? She's already had a yellow banana. I've got to go pick fruit, like me. And I've got to leave an orange one. Yeah. Oh, looks like I'm last. A blue fruit? That's not easy. Ah, blueberries. Now I've got to find a shape sign post and leave a shape. Where is that sign shape post? There, a pyramid. An orange cube. It looks a bit like me. This way to the maze. Leave a book or a toy. I'll leave a book or a toy. Oh, this is one of my favorite stories. Ooh. Leave a book or a toy. Oh, right. Um, what shall I leave? Where has the sign post gone? gone? I can't see it anywhere. Leave a book or a toy. A blue tray. Dink must be in the lead. 
，暗中玻璃杯。电影是吗？电影是。快点，快点，快点，快点，快点！ Dinks the winner. But he was the slowest. How did you do it, Dink? Well, I just took it steadily. I was driving so fast, I missed the last signpost, and I was so busy reading my story, I forgot where I was going. Well done, Dink. You killed me. Let's see if learning will can tell us more. Hello, Cubies. What do you think is better, learning wall, fast or slow? That depends where you want to go, Doody. Let me tell you a little story about a snail who wanted to go fast. Simon the snail lived on a wall. His life was nothing but one long crawl. There were so many places he wanted to go, but the journey to get there seemed ever so slow. Crawling takes time. I can't get very far. So Simon decided to buy a small car. He swerved through the flowers. He flattened the veil. He just missed the point and went into the hedge. And the car wouldn't drive up the garden wall, said Simon. This vehicle is no good at all. I want to go faster. I must think again. So Simon decided to buy a small train. The train was quite fun, and it made a nice sound. But its wheels would not turn on the damp, muddy ground. For trains will not run without any track. This vehicle is hopeless. I'm taking it back. He thought and he thought for a whole afternoon, and then he decided to buy a balloon. The hot air balloon rose into the sky. He waved at the worms as he passed them all by. Then Simon shouted, "I must get down quick! This kind of travel is making me sick. I don't like the car, the balloon, the train." I know," said Simon. "I'll buy a small plane." He drove down the path and flew into the air. He circled the garden without a care. Everyone, look at clever old me. He said as the wings got stuck in a trip. This plane will not last on a very long trip. So Simon decided to buy a spaceship. The spaceship was fast. It whizzed and it spun. Flying that thing was incredible fun. Simon zoomed up with a smile on his face. Away from the garden and up into space. Behind him, he left the planes, trains, and cars. And the last thing I heard, he had nearly reached Mars. <laughs> You nearly missed our exercises. Exercises? Of course. We haven't done them yet. Off we go. Come on, everybody, and bend. And stretch. And now we're going to jump. Jump. And clap. That's it. And again. Jump. 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 Jump.
was fun. fun. <laughs> I like we going really fast. Yeah. Can we go well, on our adventure now, to Martin, Boz? Ma? Yes. Oh, yeah. Cubies we'll at the we'll ready, to please. Where shall we go? What shall we do? I don't know. Do you? Do you? We could go here. We could go there. Cubies, 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 C
It's got four tiny feet. And a little head. Oh, it's oh, how sweet. Oh, I know. It's a tortoise. Yeah. 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 How do you no, start a teddy bear race? Tell us, Nanny Wolf. Ready, teddy, teddy go. Look. Once there were three teddies. One red, one blue, one green. Red was fast, green was slow, and blue was in between. Red was always running. Blue preferred to walk. Green did not go anywhere. He liked to sit and talk. Red ate very quickly. He gobbled down his food. Blue ate nicely with his spoon and thought that Red was rude. Green just nibbled slowly. His breakfast took all day. He chewed his food a thousand times and then went out to play. Which teddy do you like the best? The red, the blue, or green? I like the red teddy. I like the green one. The blue one. Thanks, Lily. Thank you, Xie Qiang. You're welcome, Xie Qiang. Goodbye, 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 Xie Qiang. Ready? Steady. Go. I'm the boss. I'm a suitcase. You're too hungry. I know. I'm thinking. And I'm a box of biscuits. I'm a suitcase. I'm a present. I'm a football. And I'm a, a music player. Come on, Kubi Man, go back. It's time we had an adventure. Where should we go? What shall we do? I don't know. Do you? Do you? Do you? We could go here. We could go there. Kubi Man, go anywhere. Take us somewhere exciting, boss. Ready? Yeah! Wow! The maze! Oh, Have you seen my nephew? No. We only just arrived. I'm looking after it. And he's run off. Don't worry, we'll look for him. I'm sure he's quite safe in the maze, but we'll find him. Oh, thank you. We'll be quicker on our skaters. Skeezers can bounce, skeezers can hop Jumping so high they go over the top Skeezers are fun Come on everyone We're skeetering high, we're skeetering low Sometimes we're fast, sometimes we're slow Our skeezers will go where we want them to go Skeezers are fun Come on everyone Skeezers can hop Skeeters can make a humming sound They twist and they turn and spin round and round Skeeters are fun Come on everyone Skeeters are fun Let's try in here. I can hear laughter. Wammy Wiggs! I mean, Wiggy Wam! Excuse me, can you just stop rolling around for one second? Sorry, I can't walk on to Bolia. Why? We can't walk on to Bolia. 
There must be some reason. Is it your birthday? No. Have you won a competition? No. Has somebody told you about it? Come on, Tubies. We've a job to finish. We haven't found Bobby Bingle Boingle yet. He's not here. That's for sure. My skeeter's gone. That's very strange. It can't go off by itself. No, somebody has to ride it. But who would take my skeeter without asking? There's only one way to find out. Use your remote control, Jimmy. Of course. My remote control will find the skeeter and bring it straight back to me. Hey, don't do that. You're meant to be going the other way. I can hear it. Well, if it isn't Bobby Bingle Boy, your auntie has been looking for you everywhere. She's very upset and worried. Hmm. I didn't mean to upset her. I was only playing. I know. But it's better to stay with the person looking after you. Yes, and I'm sorry I borrowed your skeeter without asking first, Judy. It just looks so cool. Well, at least you're safe. Oh, 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 Bobby, there you are. Oh, yeah. I'm so glad to see you. Thank you so much, Bobby. No problem. We need to be together. What's wrong, Judy? Why are you looking so sad? Because it's time to go. It's always sad when you get to the end of something. Except that when you get to the end of something, it means it's time to start something new. That's true. Now you're happy again. Come on, Cubie man, come on.